children, hope you're all okay. We have loved seeing all of the work that you did on Wellbook Day yesterday. So today, this is our last day of home learning. So today in literacy, we're still focusing on Farmer Duck and we would like you to play a listening game on phonics play and you would need to listen to the animal sound and pick the correct animal that makes that sound. Then we'd like you to think about what are the animals on the farm in Farmer Duck? Do you think they would be happy with the farmer? Do you think you could choose one animal from the story and write a speech bubble as you are the animal on the farm? So how do you think they feel? What do you think they might say? So I've done an example here, um, which I've put on the school spider of the duck, but you can choose any animal you want and you can draw a picture of it as well. In phonics, we would like you to practice your phase three tricky words, which are her, me, we, and they. And then we would like you to practice your spellings and they were be, we, me, and all. How many did you get right? And in maths, we'd like you to continue practicing counting using our splat square. So one more, one less, forwards and backwards from, 20, from one to 20. And then today we would like you to make a clock. So you can use anything at your house. You might have a paper plate. You might cut up a cereal box into a circle. We'd like you to try and write the numbers one to 12 and where you think they might go on a clock. We have put a link to a Top Marks um, website so you can have a little look at the clock to see what it looks like to help you. And then we would like you to make some different o'clock times as well with that. And in the afternoon, we're practicing um, and we're learning all about healthy foods. So we would like you to listen to the story called I Will Not Ever Eat a Tomato. Okay. And then we'd like you to think about why do you need to eat healthy foods? What is the big problem in the story? What did Lola learn in the end? So I want you to have a think about what sort of foods we should eat every day and what foods we should only eat sometimes. Okay. And then we've put up a worksheet and we would like you to create a healthy lunch, okay, for Ronnie the rabbit and Eddie the teddy, so our class bears in school. So can you draw the food in the lunchbox and can you label it as well? And your wellbeing activity for today is play a game with a family member. So it might be a game of hide and seek, it might be a card game, it might be a board game. We hope you have a lovely day and we cannot wait to see you back in school. Bye!